Thank you, Tyler. Our main weather is brought to you by Fire Farms. Fire Farms is Belfast's number one dispensary, offering a great selection of pipes, water pipes, CBD products, and much more. And a warm day out there today. Once again, temperatures around 40 degrees. We're not used to this. We saw near 50 just yesterday. So incredibly warm temperatures. 40 degrees by Bar Harbor. Take a look at this though, up north, Greenville, Millinocket area, mid to upper 30s. Of course, they're up north, no surprise there. Still a bit of snow is on the ground, but we did melt a lot of snow we had just a few days ago. And then look what happens by tomorrow, 33 degrees and then 45 by Saturday, right back down into those mid to upper 20s by next week. So finally, it's gonna feel once again like winter. For now though, cloudy skies, a couple of flurries are possible. Is New York City getting snow? No, guys, almost two full years of less than one inch of snowfall in New York City. Incredible stuff. I used to live in New York City and I'm a big snow lover, so thank gosh I am not there now. But record breaking, the definitely record breaking stuff down into New York City. Nothing like that here, guys. Of course, we're in Maine. Things are a lot colder compared to what they're used to in New York City. For now, cloudy skies, some flurries in the area here and there, but don't worry, this is just maybe a trace. That's what we're talking about overnight tonight into early tomorrow morning. And then look what happens. The next couple of days, a little bit more snow will be rolling in, but snow at first and then a little bit of rain in the next couple of days. Now, snow on the ground right now, it's showing two inches. We're looking at just less than that, especially with those warmer temperatures the last couple of days. And that's what we're expecting. Uh, more snow and then more rain that will continue to wash all of that snow away. So get ready. A lot more rain, I would say, is on the way. Now, we don't have any winter storm warnings or advisories out. We do have some high wind watches, though, posted right by the coast. And then, of course, some small craft advisories in effect off the coast. If you are out and about, please be careful. Winds are pretty light, anywhere between a five to 15 mile per hour breeze all over the state. So winds, nothing to really worry about there. Now for tonight though, temperatures back in those mid twenties, mainly cloudy skies. A few flurries will be possible. Light winds once again for tomorrow though, temperatures near freezing. We're going to see some decreasing clouds. So lots of clouds in the morning hours and then a good amount of sunshine by the afternoon hours tomorrow. And then a little bit of flurries rolling in Friday night into Saturday morning. We are looking at that snow in the area Saturday morning. Temperatures will be rising mid 40s outside, so that snow will become rain and it will wash all of that snow away. Then on the back end, a couple of rain and snow showers will be possible. And then we really cool off with temperatures back in the 20s. Beth and Peter.